In this video, we will learn how to deal with a Dragonite Ore, Imperial Fragments, and Bloodstone Dust. And before we get started, we have reached our 300 subscribers milestone. So I will be making a small giveaway, and all the details are at the end of the video. Hello everyone, I focus on making short and simple guides on different topics for new and casual players. So make sure to subscribe and enable the notifications to know when the guides are posted. To make things easy, instead of saying Dragonite Ore, Imperial Fragments and Bloodstone Dust every time, I will just call them Ascended Materials for short. The best way to deal with Ascended Materials is to craft Heatstone and then sell it on the trading post. This item sells for about 15-16 gold at the time, so you make a very decent amount of profit. Crafting this item will consume 200 ascended materials each, so you will free up a lot of space in few days. But this method is not the easiest and not for everyone, because there are four conditions. You can only craft heat stone once per day, you need to have an armor smith or a tailor or leather work at level 500 and you need to buy an item from the mystic forge npc that will cost 20 spirit shards you also will need a recipe that you can buy from dry top but only if it is tier 3 this is not very hard to do even if you are not on an organized map just keep doing many events as much as you can this will give you the currency you need to buy the recipe and also increase the tier of the map. The second method is by using converters. Those are items that consume ascended materials and in return give you some junk items. There are a total of 7 converters. Each one have a limited amount of use per day and each one have a different achievement that you need to complete in order to get the converter. Some of those achievements are easy, and others are a little hard. The third method is by crafting some utility stones, or crystals, or oils. And at the time, only toxic focusing crystals are the ones that will make profit. To be able to craft them, you will need an artificier level 450, and a recipe that you can buy from the trading post, or can be sold randomly from the packed supply merchants. There are also two other utility types. They are Corsair and Magnanimous. Those are account bound and you cannot sell them on the trading post. And some of them work really well with certain builds. The Corsair recipes are sold at Domain of Esten and they are sold at this vendor which you can talk to after you finish the heart. And the Magnanimous are sold at Draconis Mons and you can talk to this heart vendor after you finish the heart. I will leave the stats of the utilities in the description. The fourth and last method is by crafting ascended armor and weapons. If you are planning to craft some of them in the near future, then you will need a lot of those ascended materials, and so you should save them. Now before we talk about the giveaway, I would like to thank everyone very much for the support in all its forms, especially by subscribing. I really appreciate your support and am grateful for it. So we have 50 mystic coins for the first place and a stack of globs of ectoplasm for the second place. All you have to do to participate in the giveaway is to leave a comment with your in-game username. This is the one that have numbers in it and the winners will be picked randomly. After exactly 48 hours of this video's date, once we know who the winners are, I will send you an in-game mail with your items in it. And we are done. Thank you very much for watching.